any 9000 basic setup. Peri pump, also known as any 9000 peristaltic programmable pump. Begin by plugging your power supply to the wall power or a power strip. If you're using a power strip, make sure the power strip is turned on. Plug your power supply into the back of the pump, round connector, and then turn on the pump by pressing the switch. You will hear a beep. That means the pump's power is turned on and the display will be blinking. The LEDs will be lit. Press any key to stop the display from blinking. Installing the cassette. The NE9000 comes with a starter kit including cassette, 3 16 ID tubing with connectors already attached. a vial of grease, and two extra zip ties. The tubing has the zip ties attached, both in the same direction. Installing the tubing. To install the tubing, remove the rotor. Apply the grease to the spindle. The head that comes with the pump is pre-greased. Put the rotor back in. Apply a small amount of grease to the tubing. Insert the connector into the space in the head facing down. Pull the head out slightly and rotate to align the tubing. Insert the second connector into the second pocket. The tubing should roll freely. Match the two slots on the head to the two slots on the motor. Rotate the head, aligning the tabs on the head and base. Press and turn to lock into place. You can install the head to face various directions. Direction of pumping is indicated by the arrow. This tube goes to the reservoir, upper to the output. Set infusion rate. To set the rate of infusion, press the rate key. The currently stored rate is 500 ml per minute. To change the units of the flow rate, Use any up arrow key to change the units. To change the decimal point, simultaneously press both up arrow keys under where you want the decimal point to be. When the blinking stops, the new value is entered. Now you can start running the pump. Set volume rate. Press the volume key to show the volume target. Off indicates continuous pumping. Press the volume keys to set a volume target. Press the volume key again to show the units dispensed. Change units used from ml to ounces. While displaying ml and dispensed, Press the up arrow keys. Change units used from ml to ounces. When it stops blinking, it's entered. With continuous pumping off. While displaying ml and dispensed, press the up arrow keys. 
When it stops blinking, it's entered. Ready for operation. Purging. Begin purging the tubing by drawing liquid up. Press and hold the start key. Display shows PURG and will pump as long as you hold the key. Release the key to stop the pump. Press start to run the pumping program. The pump stops when the volume target is reached. Display the volume dispensed. Press volume to display the volume dispensed. The pumping rate can be changed while pumping. When stopped, the pumping direction can be changed to withdraw. Press start to empty the tubing. Reverse process to infuse.